Hello, this is Y'all Weasel, let's play Saga Frontier. In the last episode, we lost to bosses! Multiple! In uh, between episodes, unsurprisingly, I did some grinding, so everybody's up a little bit. They're not up as much as I was hoping, but oh well, I'm only willing to spend so much time grinding before I give it another go. So I'm gonna try to try to attack the Griffin again. Importantly, everyone except for Acellus now has at least one healing ability. So Zosma in, I think, Mystic Sword? Yeah, in his Mystic Sword has uh, Magic Heal. Rouge, of course, has Starlight Heal. Ilden has Starlight Heal. Did I also absorb that? No, no, Ilden has Starlight Heal. And Say has Magic Heal. So everyone can heal except Acellus, and everyone can heal Acellus. So I'm, I'm at least set up with healing, if nothing else. So let's see if I how yeah, let's see how set up I am. Can I just like bypass this boss? I just want whatever's back here. Actually, I don't even want that. I don't know why I'm here. This isn't even a boss. This is like a sideline. Hello, I'm behind you. Okay. I have no idea why I'm fighting this boss. I really don't have a clue. It's bizarre. Like I'm just fighting a griffin for no reason. I, it just sort of. I, let's kill a griffin. Okay, why not? Uh, I took Phantom whatever off of her. Oh, the other thing! God, I almost forgot to mention. She got the two-gun ability, which is fantastic! Uh, but we'll get to what that actually means once she's shooting, which will hopefully not be too long from now. And let's give you a glass shield, and let's give everyone a shield, and let's give you a glass shield. And... You really don't have anything better to do than maybe Sacred Song, see if that works. Oh, and he's in the form that gives him 122 WP, so he's well off, that's good. So yeah, I'm feeling relatively good. Relatively well prepared in terms of, sort of, the abilities and spells that I have. I don't know if I'm leveled up enough, but I'm leveled up. Way to immediately destroy the glass shield, thank you so much for that one. 693, that's not bad. I think I'll have to live with that. Say he doesn't seem to do a lot of damage, unfortunately. I'm trying to remember with monsters, because all of the different races have different sort of abilities in terms of leveling up. Um, let's see, use your Mystic Sword. So, for instance, Mystics, you can see, even though I gave them nice swords because I wanted them to, to be swords people, they never learn abilities like humans do. They only learn abilities through absorbing them into their Mystic Sword and such. Uh, so he's got some pretty nice abilities absorbed into his Mystic Sword. In fact, I should be using those, I don't know why I'm not. <laughs> uh, Titus Wave. Sure, why not? That could be good, I have no idea. I'm actually going to use Implosion, because I feel like uh, Vermilion Sand is probably more expensive than it's worth. Uh, right, like I was saying, everybody has different means of learning abilities, and it's just weird management with monsters, and I'm never quite sure if I'm doing the right thing with them. Uh, so Sacred Song did 693, let's see how Kusanagi does. Way to do that before he got up his glass shield. If you can just stick with Beak, though, I'll be relatively happy. Wow! Implosion did 1,188, not bad at all. I love how mystical change still happens even when you miss, but not when it's deflected. That's so bizarre. Wow, Kusanagi did 1,010? That's more than... Oh, I'm, never mind. I'm not going to try and understand. Okay, Titus Wave doesn't work if they're on the ground. That's good to know. Crystallizer probably also doesn't work if they're on the ground. Now, look at her icon. Look, it's two guns, and yet it still only uses one bullet, and it doubles the damage for free. Just having the the ability equipped doubles her damage for free. It's freaking amazing. I like it a lot. Oh, huh, okay. So I think I've got a pretty good setup here, actually. How does Phantasm Shot do against you? Actually, I don't know why I'm not at least trying. Rava, whatever it was. Rava shot. All these shots. Rava shot, Phantasm shot, Kusanagi. Look at this. 2,663. Not bad. Yes, I like double guns. Okay, so as you can see... Ho <laughs> ho Let's see this. This will be good. Phantasm shot. Rava shot. And implosion. <laughs> 
3,423, I won't complain. So, as you can see, I'm better set up now, so I'm gonna continue this in fast motion. Bzzz. Yes! Oh, oh, man! Oh, that was so much easier! Oh, level five! Level five combo! Oh, it feels amazing! Sure, absorb the Griffin. Oh, Griffith Scratch is really good, actually. Eh, put him back in his default form, though, so he doesn't have as much WP. Not that I came anywhere near using it against this Griffin. And Celestial Leather, so we immediately skinned the poor thing, jeez. Gina, it was you! Are you okay? What?! Is... What?! <laughs> wow, I really need a second to think about this. So that was Gina, and I guess we could have just not rescued Gina at all. Does she get to be another lesbian love interest now? <laughs> Lady Acellus, it's you, yes? <clears throat> oh, I gave her the wrong voice there, too. <clears throat> Lady Acellus, it's you. Now, I'm starting to believe in the existence of miracles. Yes, I'm alright. I was trapped inside this monster. Thank you for saving me. Or luge this to you? So wait, that makes me really wonder. So if I had come he through here earlier, and actually grinded up enough to beat that giant, and then came in here, would I have just broke the whole game? <laughs> oh well. Or luge did this to you? <clears throat> no, it was Rostamon. He brought me here and sealed me inside the monster. Why would Rostamon do this? Any idea, Ilden? I don't understand him. He's been acting weird ever since that incident with Seato. The incident. <laughs> you gotta give me a chance with these cutscenes. Challenging Seato, kidnapping an innocent girl. This is not like Rostovan at all. Maybe. Maybe. I will wait here for you. So that whole boss was just for a little bit of plot? Really? That, that surprises me a lot, actually. Quick save, remember? Save before and after every boss. And actually, rather than just cutting out battles, I'm gonna fast forward my way back up to Peru to the next boss. And we made it! You know, I've made fun of that last area for being almost impossible to actually hit any enemies. This time I managed to hit two. Like, the only point of the game where it actually matters. Let me talk to you from behind. Oh, yep, yep, already seen that, 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 those messages. I have not seen it flash all crazy like that, that was weird. Yes, yes, we've seen you before. Let's just see how screwed we are this time around. Okay, get everybody's glass shields going. Definitely want to keep those on. Those are always, always nice. Uh, you shield everyone. You get your glass shield going. Uh, don't punch him, that would be silly. Kusanagi actually seems pretty good. I think I was sort of overestimating the value of Sacred Song. It's very nice, but it's really nice enough that against two or more enemies it easily makes up for the, the extra WP cost. It's not so nice that it's worth it when you don't have a bunch of enemies. Well, she survived. That's something. Definitely want to keep everybody in good health, so try and keep that in mind. Ah, Glass Shield. How I love it. Okay, now I can let you go to 
Mystic Mode. Again, I'm confused because it gives her instant access to that, even though she's not in Mystic Mode yet, but okay, whatever you want to do. <laughs> confusing. And let's Magic Heal Acellus, just because he could technically kill her in one shot if he decides to do that same shot again. Again, Implosion actually seems pretty nice. I was, you know, Vermilion Sand is really nice, but it's more than three times as expensive, so I'll go with Implosion. And... I don't know, you're so useless. I just do Phantasm Shot, you idiot. <laughs> and Kusanagi, of course. See, that does 1596 right there, so like, why would I want more? That's pretty darn good. Mystical ch oh, yeah, the Mystical Change! For a second I thought it was somebody else's Mystic Sword, nope. Are you gonna attack us this turn? <laughs> How did all of us get our attacks out before you? Ooh, Crystallizer is so nasty. Usually it hits more than one person. Okay, I'm gonna continue this in fast motion. I'm confused! <laughs> I didn't do that much grinding! I really thought I might have under-grinded Grundled Grundle Grond. Okay! Bye, Lion Princess! Bye-bye! <laughs> okay? I'm kind of shocked! I might have a chance against this final boss, and look at that! Two of them get more JP and nothing else. Silly. What? Received. Well, I, I, okay, this is probably not Gina's voice, even though it's like that. Received Golden Lion. Lion Princess. What the hell does that mean? Well, that was the most confusing thing I've ever seen! Received Golden Lion? Was that... is that a weapon? Oh yeah, attack power 75! Not bad! Uh, let's see, that's 69. We'll give you, Golden Lion, Zosma, and Ilden. Yours is still all the way down at 52, which is great because Obsidian was already better, so oops. So I'll give you Silver Moon too, and actually, so long as uh, uh, Zosma has two swords, you may as well have two swords too. Quick save. Now, I think we all know what time it is. No, this isn't the final battle, this is some idiot! Lady Acellus, I've been waiting for you. Now, the, now's the time for you to defeat Orluge and become ruler of Fasanaturu. Ruler? I have no intention of doing that. Yes, I do! I want to do that! I want to be ruler of Fasanaturu, why not? But I do have every intention of paying him back. Then please take this Pluto armor. Okay, somebody else has got a uh, grudge against the Lord of all Mystics. Boy, I love scrolling through all this crap. 35, that's not even that great. <laughs> uh, and half my team can't, can't equip it, so he could. Yeah, he's the only one who could. She's got this, and maybe I could build something better than 50 out of other stuff, but I'm not willing to try. So, okay, you've got Pluto armor now. Not bad. Improve Rouge's defense by five, I won't complain. So, I suspect that the final boss is right beyond this edge of the screen. And of course, we'll be seeing him next time! Until then, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, feel free to leave a like below. Cheers! From Yaweasel.